The police yesterday introduced a sticker system relating to the personnel and vehicles allowed on roads during the travel restricted period. It was also intended to make the verification process easier for law enforcement authorities, reducing repeated checks. Eleven different colour coded stickers were introduced for various categories of essential services. As such, a green sticker will be used to represent the health sector and a light blue sticker identifies tri forces and police personnel. The employees of private and state sectors will be identified with purple and pink coloured stickers. Meanwhile, a light brown coloured sticker will be used on all vehicles transporting persons employed at factories, manufacturing and import and export sector. In contrast, a yellow sticker will be used to identify essential delivery services, while persons delivering essential commodities will be recognised by using a red sticker. An orange coloured sticker is attributed for media personnel. According to the police, a white sticker will be pasted on the vehicles of persons travelling to and from airports. Individuals with humanitarian requirements such as travelling for a doctor's appointment, to purchase medications or to attend a funeral will be identified using a black sticker. In the meantime, a grey sticker will be used to identify persons delivering cooked food. As such, traffic flowing into Colombo was regulated and verified with the use of the sticker system today. Sticker here, Surakshita, Tabaganimoto, Kati to Kareti, Obewahani, a Sura demimata, a Vikurti Kirimata, Kati to Nokaletui, a Auba Vita Kirimata, Obagi Wahani, a Venatai Kutu Labadimata, Obagi Aturpedi, a Venatai Kutu Labadimata, Kati to Nokaletui, Yamkisi Kene, Tama Veta, Pavarat, Mima, Dikari, Balea Saita sticker here, Auba Vita Kirimati, Labaduno, Eite Rehivita, Dadivaniti, Kriat Makarno, own Aneke Kulesa, Penny City, Matam Keniku, Dakura Tibinona, Ima Varda Tanubala. Sambandim Kriakrimata Balapurtuino. Emenma Mema sticker, Alava Tibuna, Yam Sakasaita Vahania, Evagim Ahamu Parikshavak Sidukrimata, Police at Araksha Hamudavant, Kisima Badavakne, Mema sticker, Alavima Magin, Sampurna Muktia, Kisuku Labinine. In the meantime, Chief of the National Operations Center for the Prevention of Covid nineteen, Army Commander General Shavendra Silva. Rubbished all rumors regarding an extension to the lockdown. Api Menakota, Mevani Tatuan, Atikiri Mata, Visheshima, Visheshatna Varun, Nikut Avalun Labadin, Nudesha, Saka Chaka Latamai, Samani, Mevani Tiran Labagan. The Kota Ye Dine Venavita, Metavadurata, Dirga Kalyutuki, Nizesha, Apivita Labilane, Eteka Matigar Janatuma, Vetavat, Kari Sadaka Balakayata, Mevani Nizesha Kailane, Samani, Memadia Tidi, Danun Deno, Namut, Idiri, Vadana, the Hatrin Tau Satya Tibena. Idriyadi, Rati Tibina Tatu, Sam Avasta, the Vislation Ekron Labanopi. Ehidi, a Vislation and Valtanu, Avashatavia Kuot, Onevala, Rate Janata, Vinu, Karan Pulua, Namut Danate Venetatia Kailane. In other developments, 77 Gram Nildara divisions located across 11 districts were freed from their status of isolation earlier today. However, even though the Gram Nildara divisions were brought out of isolation, the travel restrictions currently imposed across the country are applicable to those areas as well. In the meantime, several private banks announced today that all their branches will be closed for a week, starting from today. The decision was made taking into consideration the travel restrictions that are currently in place across the country. Accordingly, branch networks of Commercial Bank of Ceylon, Sampath Bank, Ceylon Bank, DFCC Bank, Nations Trust Bank, Amana Bank and the Union Bank of Colombo will remain closed during the coming week. However, Hatton National Bank stated that their branches will be closed only on the 8th and 9th of June. With this being the case, the banks urged their customers to use digital banking services to fulfill their requirements. Low and handsome. A the multivitamin sa UV filters degunekin vadi deep tiaklabade. Unagana hitan. Hirukirin araksha karagan.